Now let us discuss the next problem. So this is uh, a sterification, easy problem. We will go fast for this problem. So this is 10.41. I will go fast in this case, easy problem. You have to write down the esterification product. You have to write esterification product. So what is the product after esterification? So you have to write esterification product. Now the first is we have A, we have CH3, CH2, CH2, COOH and this plus CH3OH. Now uh, what will be the final product you will have? This is a basically easy one you can you have to simply remove the one molecule of water. You see, here you have CS3. Now let us say CS3, CH2, CH2, and COOH. OH, and this side plus OH, CS3. Are you getting? If you simply remove one molecule of water, you will get the answer. So if you remove one molecule of water from here, what are you getting? That is the esterified product. CH3, CH2, CH2, C double bond O, CH3. So this is the product, final product after esterification. Are you getting? Uh, let us discuss the B part. This is again easy. You have to write down the esterified product from this. You have alcohol. This is a phenol. Uh, plus this side you have a acid. Let me make something like this so that things becomes easy. Let us write down the esterified product in this case. I think you can write this one. So if you see, you can remove one molecule of water from here. We will discuss the mechanism of this reaction also. This is esterification reaction. Later we will discuss the mechanism of this reaction also. So you will have so let me write product here are you able to see yeah so you will have this o co and here you will have ch3 are you getting now let us do c part so part c you have again one acid plus one alcohol so this side you have benzoic acid so this molecule is called benzoic acid COOH plus you have alcohol also CH3 CH2OH so let me write OH this side so OH CH2 CH3 uh, what will be the product in this case once again you have to lose one molecule of water so let us say you remove H2O and write down the final product so keep doing so let us write down the final product if you lose one molecule of water. So the final product will be CO OCH2 CH3. So this is the final product. Let us discuss D part. So D part is the easy one again. So you have two molecules of alcohol plus H3PO4. So you have two molecules of CH3CH2OH and this is done in the presence of H3PO4. So H3PO4 is basically acting as a catalyst. So what will be the product in this case? Once again you can use the same thing. You can lose one molecule of water. So let me give you a hint. CH3CH2OH OH CH2CH3 and if you lose one molecule of water from here, you will get the esterified product. You see in these cases basically and the reaction that is happening, in this case that is a carbocation. First you will make a carbocation and the next molecule lone pair of oxygen will attack on the carbocation. So you will have final product is easy to write CH3CH2OCH2CH3. Are you getting? Now let us discuss E part. So this is again easy one. 
we have CH3OH plus HNO3. So let me write the structure of HNO3. HNO3 is this. HNO3. So you will have a double bond O. So this is your HNO3. So this molecule is nothing but HNO3. If you want you can write the same bond in terms of formal charges also. So what will be the product? So once again you can lose one molecule of water. So if you lose one molecule of water here. So you will get CH3O and O and double bond O here. Are you getting or not? So this is the final product you will have. So let us copy this one and then we will discuss the next problem. So this is a all esterification kind of reaction in each case you have to lose one molecule of water. Are you getting? Simple one. Okay, let us go for the next problem.